Well, uh, I just woke up this morning and for some reason just had this Irish feel about it. Um, when I went outside, um, we'd had some rain overnight, so there's some nice puddles and stuff on the ground and the sun was out and it just reminded me so much of being in Ireland, um, well, two years ago now. So I um, just decided, well, I've tried many beef and goodness pies in my time and I thought, well, why not try and make one myself? So that's what I'm doing today. I've just got the, the uh, casserole steak, just um, just browning away. Um, just found a recipe online and just got carrot, onion, just cutting that up. Uh, I have some potato. It wasn't in the original recipe, but I'm like, yeah. how can you have a beef against pie without potato or anything Irish without potato in it? Not at all potato. So put that in. Uh, celery and of course the most important ingredient. Um, a bit of that gear, 250th anniversary Guinness. Uh, still got some left over, which I bought a case of a while ago now. But um, anyway, uh, just I'm just gonna have a go at it and just see how it, ha how it turns out. So, got the meat, onion, carrot, potato, and celery in there at the moment. It's all looking um, not too bad, really. I don't mind that. But anyway, there's a very, very, very important ingredient that we have yet to put in yet. Um, we all know what it is. Um, now, oh, there goes one of the caps. Um, this wasn't an important ingredient. Uh, anyway, so now this this recipe uh, asks for 500 mils of Guinness, and uh, unfortunately I've only got two 330 mils, which means that some of it may have to be drunk. So um, it is at 8:30 in the morning that um, what Guinness has done for me in my time. I, I think I'm happy to uh, to take that take that and. So I think we're ready. So it's all the first one. So I want the other more. Okay. I'll have a little bit of this one. Just to make sure it's okay. Yep, yep that's okay. Alright. So it's foaming up quite nicely in here. I don't know actually how much of a second bottle I'll be able to get in there, which is unfortunate. Um, I'll see how it goes. Make sure this one's okay. Yep, that's okay. Now I think that's about much as I'm willing to put in. Alright. I'm going to put something down. Just so I can show you this bit of foaming that's going on here. That's how it looks. The smell of Guinness is there. Which, um, very nice and now I just have to let it simmer for about two hours now so uh, I'm just gonna uh, enjoy some more Guinness songs maybe play with Ness um, Pretty close to two hours now, and uh, 
it's uh, reduced quite a bit in here. Just see if I can show you it. So as you can see, it's going uh, pretty well. Um, I think it's about time to, I guess, uh, put in. But I suppose we should sort of make sure this meat's tender. Yep, that's it. We're good. Throw this all in. It actually seems to fit pretty well, so I think I've, I've budgeted it all out. The ingredients and all that pretty well. I have enough. Probably could have a bit more Guinness, but because it's just looking a little bit dry. But that's how it sort of looks. Try not to lose any of it. Um, so I'll just chuck it in and uh, see how we go. Oven at 190. Uh, actually sure how long it's been in here for, but I'm sure as soon as we'll try it anyway. Give it a go. Voila, that is it. Now let me just check the recipe here. Forty-five minutes. Ah, oh, sick. So I can play a bit more, uh, a bit more Nintendo. Awesome. I'll be back in a bit, and we can see the results. Yay! Well, here it is. Uh, my first beef and Guinness pie. Um, the uh, it smells pretty good, and uh, I'm just going to try and have a go of it and just see how it is. Um, it smells really good. Anyway. Traditional fashion, just going to start fashioning it in. That's a nice chunk of beef and Guinness pie, I can tell you that right now. Ah, forgetting one thing. That's better. Nice chunks of meat. Everything seems to have cooked through quite well. It's very chunky. Mmm. Warm. Very warm. best I've had but I'll tell you what nice tender meat again it's a little bit dry as I thought it would be um, <clears throat> apart from that the first attempt I'm pretty damn happy with that mm. more Guinness